Good morning everybody, Lone Wolf Rick here and it is Sunday morning, July 17th here on the Las Vegas Strip and it's kind of overcast here uh, we had a little bit of a sprinkle this morning uh, it didn't really amount to anything but it was a little bit of a sprinkle you see a helicopter up there flying around take a look at the sky up there it's supposed to get up to 110 degrees again today so right now it's really kind of muggy out here so there's definitely some rain it's like around the area hope everybody's having a good weekend myself I'm a little wore out it's a it was a hectic last 24 hours to be honest with you uh, with the stuff I experienced last night and, and uh, had trouble couldn't fall asleep last night so it was just one of those uh, one of those kind of days you know but today's another day and we're back at it again doing what we do we'll just roam around here and see what's going on today I already posted two videos this morning. I posted uh, my video from last night at the Link uh, Promenade that I do every Saturday evening. And I'm walking around there, and, uh, pretty busy last night there. Uh, busier than it's been the last couple of weeks, so uh, that was good to see. And I posted a video this morning also of uh, my experiences of what I uh, what I saw and what I. Uh, uh, witnessed and everything from last night and the fear and the panic that was caused but uh, I'll, tell you, I'll tell you something that's interesting I posted that video uh, which is basically going to be me talking about what I saw and, and people you know were scared and, and this and that and uh, I get a thing from YouTube saying that the, that video could not be monetized because of the content it was an ad friendly content I'm not sure what the problem was it's like it was just me talking about my experience of what happened last night so um, it's just kind of a kind of kind of interesting I mean it's not like uh, you know that video probably would have made me a dollar fifty or whatever so it's not the money it's just that uh, I'm wondering why it's like uh, out of all the videos that are posted you know it's like uh, that video was singled out because it's just me talking about uh, what I saw so oh well anyway we're here on this Sunday morning roaming around here we've got uh, Today's the last day of the quote unquote first half of the Major League Baseball season. As the All-Star game is Tuesday at the Home Run Derby tomorrow night. And all the players get a uh, what they get like a four day break uh, before having to be back to, for next weekend. So I mentioned in another video, it's like I kinda miss it. Yeah, with all the walking I do, walking around and everything, it, uh, it kind of uh, was a nice break in the day, you know, when you could go in and sit for an hour or whatever and uh, catch some baseball games and just relax a little bit. That's okay, it's only four days, right? Yeah, I wanted to let you all know also... Um, at the Hawaiian village up here uh, you know all those businesses closed down except for the two there was that uh, Smokey's restaurant that was open and uh, there was that cannabis store that was still open uh, those two were running uh, running their normal business uh, like they were however it's like uh, those businesses as I saw this morning those businesses are closed also 
Uh, they were open uh, yesterday, to be honest with you. So I'm assuming last night was the last, uh, at least the restaurant was open. Let me go that far. I remember seeing that one open yesterday. But uh, they are officially closed. So that whole mall now is completely shut down. And they're ready for the, uh, I guess, the tear down and, and rebuild. A little more upscale shops and upscale uh, dining, upscale bars. That's uh, what they're going to build in there. And those two shopping centers, so just, uh, so it should be a pretty nice, pretty big complex there, so. Look at that. the sign in there says, only three days left. I'm hoping this clock, you know, this clock cover is pretty nice. I'm hoping it hangs around. Now, even though it's still supposed to get to 110 degrees today, but you know, without the direct sunlight, it's like it makes it kind of a uh, kind of bearable. You know, it's actually, uh, with the exception of a little bit of mugginess that's going on, it actually makes it kind of uh, nice this morning. Especially when you're walking by, you know, these stores that are open and. Uh, you can feel the uh, feel the coolness coming out of them. Look inside the uh, M and M store there. They are uh, going away in there. Usually they don't have the music that loud though, so that was kind of uh, kind of strange. Everybody's everybody's trying to capture uh, what business there is out of here on the strip, you know. Trying to capture uh, anybody that's walking by. I like your hat, sir. The Coca Cola store is open. It's about the uh, I don't, I don't think I told what time it was. It was about 10 a.m. It started this video here. Yeah. Look over the the line at Denny's is back. That's good to see. I guess. It was funny there was a uh, somebody said something the other day it's like uh, can you imagine uh, you know you travel halfway across America or halfway across the world to come to Las Vegas just to eat at Denny's I'm like yeah that's that's kind of true yeah, especially with all the food and everything that's uh, that's here Another rush of coolness coming out of that ABC store right there. Felt pretty nice. We got to uh, kind of slow down here in the action. I try to, you know, whenever I get to these spots where there's music, I try to move through them fairly quick so hopefully it doesn't pick up and I get that copyright uh, little strike thing. Sometimes it's like the traffic's too big or 
like in this case there's a little 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 dude there that was uh just kind of meandering along you know So with the closing of uh, those two places in the Hoya Marketplace, uh, the only place that it possibly could still be open would be that uh, the restaurant back there, that Korean barbecue restaurant. But I see a, uh, it's interesting because I see a U-Haul back there loading up chairs and stuff. So uh, I'm thinking that that one's probably closed also. Looks like they're back there, maybe uh, clearing out the, the last of whatever they own in there. You know, it's like, and I get that uh, you know, these malls and the that Hawaiian Marketplace mall, it's old. It, it never really uh, served the purpose of uh, what was... Uh, what was going on and okay, kind of the new Vegas and everything it's like you know with the uh, the nice resorts and everything but I think people kind of forgot and I mentioned this like uh, maybe once before I think people kind of forgot you know these were small businesses but these were businesses that were owned by mom and dad you know businesses that uh, they're trying to make a, ra a living to raise their family and and everything. These weren't major corporations that were uh, that were all in here. So you've got the small businesses that have lost their business, that are out of business, uh, which to me is kind of sad. And then you've got all the employees that were hired and all the employees that worked there that basically are out of business also you know they're uh, out looking for another job and I'm betting a lot of those employees it's like probably have worked there for years and years so basically they become they become part of the family some of the employees do So this is what I was talking about. It's like it here at this Hawaii marketplace. You know, the last two businesses that were open were this uh, this dispensary right here, and the restaurant over here, Smokies. And it is uh, it is as you can see. It's like you know they moved the ropes officially out and. It is officially closed. I think they were starting to uh, take down some of their stuff also. All right, everybody, I think that's gonna do it for this video today. At least this video right here. I'm Lil Wolf Rick, thank you very much for joining me. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, please. To our subscribers, everybody who watches our videos, thank you very, very much, we appreciate your support. All right, everybody, take care, stay healthy, okay?
and uh, we'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye, everybody.